here at the Oklahoma City Animal Shelter for Free Me Friday with Jerry and little Jerry. Coming up here to see the dogs and the cats. There's several. Um, we already walked through and took some pictures, so uh, Jerry's about to head out, but I'm going to run through and do some video. Come save a life. Yes, make or all the two. difference. Yes, yeah, or two. So, all right. Bye, see Jerry. Um, okay, so we are going to walk around. I'm going to flip it around if I can remember how to. Yeah. And see some of the kitties. Lots of kitties. These are the full growns. Just went in there. I don't want to distract that girl from getting to pet them. And we'll come check out the little kittens. So, while I'm in here and it's quiet and it's cute and sweet, um, I'm going to go over a little bit more about why I'm here. Um, Jerry White, who is just here and just left, um, he started a Free Me Friday um, where he comes up here to the shelter, takes some pictures of dogs, cats. Um, he's adopted, I think, one or two, um, as well as a cat he adopted so he could do fostering and say whether the dogs were good with a cat. So Jerry is quite the uh, MVP. He's doing doing good for everybody. Uh oh, Chad, look at this little guy. This is little mini Echo. I think he wants to come home. And then this guy. Neil, does uh, does your little guy need another cat? Or Rachel have two matching black cats? So, but I'm just gonna go over and say why I'm here. Um, guys, come down. Whether whether you're volunteering, whether you want to look into fostering, um, the shelters generally stay so full with dogs and cats, and these guys don't. They do not deserve to stay here. Um, some of them are owner surrenders. Some of them are strays. We found some today that were confiscated, so they've come out of a bad situation. And this little guy who's at my feet. Um, but they they don't deserve this. They uh, they want loving homes, um, and I'm trying to turn the camera back around because I've got a friend. <laughs> um, but come down, whether you adopt a dog, a cat, you're just doing some volunteering. Um, oh, yeah, down. Um, but come down. Don't when you when you're thinking about wanting a pet, don't go to a pet store. Uh, those things are breeded so badly. Um, I'll show you one here in a little bit. He's so inbred. He's like a dwarf. He still has a full-size head. Um, it's so sad. But definitely come, if you're not in Oklahoma City, go to your local shelter. Um, look into volunteering at your shelter. Look into being a foster. Um, it's great. The, the love of an animal, I'm telling you. When you see their faces, when they into their eyes, they're just... They're amazing. Yeah, Aaron, this facility is pretty good. Um, and actually, Jerry and I were talking, and I believe MAPS 4, I think they got the go-ahead to expand. So they will have more space, and it'll be what they call a no-kill shelter, um, which, you know, there's some, some other things to that, but it makes it where it's highly unlikely or it's a very, very, very small percent that gets put down. Um, but... Anyhow, hi little guy, you want to come home with me? But anyhow, make sure that you uh, look into going to your shelter before you um, before you buy from a pet store. Um, share this video. If, if you don't want to um, adopt, you don't want to come down, volunteer, I get that time. Um, time is all we have. So if you, if you share the video, that's better than doing nothing. So share this. Um, if any of you want to come with me, uh, Jerry and I come on Fridays. I can do multiple times. I can do other times during the week as well. But make a difference. Save a life. Um, if any of the dogs or the cats that you see you like, let me know. Um, I can get more information on them. But we're gonna, I'm going to walk through now. I say bye to this little kitten who's following my feet. <laughs> I am going to uh, walk through the dogs now. It's going to get loud. Oh, got really close. Sorry, I was looking at the cat. Not great at this Facebook Live, but trying my best. Save animals. Um, 
Yes, yes, Aaron, I sure hope it happens. That would be, that would be awesome. Um, but anyhow, we're going to walk through the docks. It's kind of loud, um, so bear with me. I probably won't be, probably won't be able to hear me very well, but share my video. Share it, share it, share it. Let's, you know, let's make a difference. Let's save lives. Um, these animals deserve it. So I'm going to flip this around, and, okay, my little kittens over there eating. So, all right, here we go through the dogs. Uh-oh, Jerry's found a, a brindle <laughs> that he's in love with, I think. <laughs> Uh-oh, it's making a difference. Oh, that poor baby, he's so sweet. <laughs> so, all right. Oh, this is Cyrus. He's ready to be adopted, so jump on in. Look how friendly he is. Jerry's son and Jerry is so sweet. So. All right. We're going to start walking in. All right. Look at these babies. This one we walked through earlier, they were a little more calm over here. It's the second room where they got a little bit more wild. Hi, baby. Hi, sweetie. Black dogs generally, you know, don't get adopted, so there's a lot of them in here, and they're so sweet. Um, same with pits, all of that. So, yes, yes, Jeff, that brindle, the one that Jerry was just playing with, yeah, he's a good-looking baby. So, if Jerry doesn't get him, you guys should come up here. So, this guy's stretching out. So, all right, all right, all right. Check out some more babies. Hi, baby. <laughs> Like I said last time, there's all breeds, there's all colors, there's all sizes, all ages, like whatever it is that is your heart's desire, they've got them down here. So make a difference. Come down here. Uh oh. Someone was getting the, uh, the free walk. So. All right. This little boy. Hi, baby. This is Rocky, one and one year old, 33 pound uh, pit bull terrier mix. Um, he, he does chase cats, so uh, there's that. <laughs> Layla. This little guy. This little guy sleeping bear. Oh yeah, he was a sweet little guy earlier. Bear, look at that face. Is it coming down? This guy standing as water did. Hi, he's okay. That's Harvey. You should come down and get Harvey. Oh, Tilly's over there resting his head. But yeah, if, if any of these dogs look like you want them, you know, you'd love to have one, let me know. I'll get all the information, um, send it to you. But definitely always consider adopting. These babies, some of them look so scared. This one's beautiful. And they shake in here when it gets loud. So come down. If you can't adopt, come down. Take them for a walk. Um, pet them, play in one of the rooms with them. Just give them that love. It's scary in here for some of these dogs. So. Honey, baby. Another brindle baby. Hi, boy. A big boy. These over here just had surgery, so I'm assuming they've all just been spayed or neutered, so they're kind of out of it. It's okay. It's okay. I don't know if you could hear me. These down here were all spayed and neutered. They're this last row. So they kind of look drugged, but they're available tomorrow for adoption. So, all right. So poor baby. It's okay. Lay down, baby. You're so sweetie again. So, all right. Hello, hello. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Adopt me. 
Hi, Jackie. You want me to get you a puppy? I know your two sweet kiddos would love it. Oh. Excuse me. Sorry. All right. I'm going to walk out of this room. I'm going to walk down to the next. Um, turn it around while I'm walking. So, um, does anybody have any questions or any uh, requests? Um, walk down this hall, long hall here. Um, oh yeah, we'll go in here real quick to these kitties. These are full-size babies. Hi, guy. We were joking earlier that it's like a movie because there's all these black cats. Here come the dog was. Hi, babies. Hey, guys, don't fight over there. Oh, full-grown kitties. They need love, too. I think there's one missing. I think that girl just adopted one, so. It's okay. Are you scared? I know. I know. Uh-oh, Corey. You spotted one you want me to bring you? Are you guys on your drive to, uh, where, where, I think Paul said you guys are going to Mexico to, to dive. Um, but he's worried about the storm, so you guys should turn around, and I'll just get you a, I'll get you a puppy, and you guys can go home, and, uh, Bad Rad can play with it, so, he'd love that. So, alright, we're gonna go back in here, it looks like they're cleaning, so, might get a little loud. Hi. Another one of those blues. His ears aren't cropped, and neither is his tail. He's a good-looking baby. And this is a little German Shepherd. So, hi, baby. Hi. Hi, babies. Hi. He's so cute. It's a fox terrier mix. Oh, wait. No, that's the wrong one. I'm not sure what that guy is. Lots of different jobs and be down here at the shelter to volunteer, so. I think these are all, they're emptied out right now. Hi 
Volunteer, come down, walk them. I mean, he's picking up poop, whatever. Uh, this is my my segue into volunteering. I had to make sure I could sit in here with them long enough to be able to handle it. But I plan on coming down and volunteering, doing my part. Um, but share, share this video. Let other people know. Like, adopt, adopt, guys. Don't shop. These poor babies. They don't they have a certain timeline, and if they get full in here, they start euthanizing. And I hate to talk about it, but I just want you to remember that next time you go to a uh, pet store, you're buying a pet, next time you meet with a breeder, uh, next time you uh, get that $1,500 cash out for that, you know, specialty breed, one of these babies here dies. So, remember that. Always, always do your part to uh, to rescue one of these babies. They're beautiful. They need love. Look at these faces. Like when you take one of these guys home with you, and you get to pet them and curl up with them, you just look at that face and you know you made a difference. You made a difference in their life. They're making. I promise you, they will make a difference in your life. The love, the unconditional love from a dog or a cat, I, it's, it's unreal. Like, no, I mean, my two at home, it's okay. It's okay. My two at home, man, they'd, they'd walk to the ends of the world. They'd do anything for me. They're so sweet. It's, it's amazing. So, come down here, adopt a dog. A small horse like this kid right here. He's massive. Hi, baby. <laughs> but yeah, there's there's one here for everybody. So remember that. Don't don't. I can't stress enough. Do not buy a dog. There's the one I was talking about. The inbreeding. Look at this little guy. His little dwarf body. Bless his heart. He's gonna have he's gonna have joints joint issues. It, that's what breeders do. They don't care. They all they care about is that dollar. So remember that these are these are babies. These are living animals. They have souls. They're just they're amazing. So don't treat them like trash. Don't throw them out when they're old, when they're sick, because they're gonna stand by you if you when you get older when you get sick. Each other. Hi, baby. 
stick your hand up to the cage, he's not as bad. So if you're uh, no children or, you know, older kids that can handle a, a rowdy dog, but he's just got lots of energy and I think he wants to play. It's okay. See, he just stands. some of these dogs are really anxious and excited in here um, don't let that deter you um, being in here it's very frightening to these dogs like you can see some of them that are shivering um, and some of them are reactive because they're scared so don't let that sway you um, I know I hate to say it but I know the shelter evaluates when they first get here and if they are show excessive signs of um, of being agitated and being aggressive, they, they are put down. So all of these have been, you know, you know, thoroughly checked and gone through. But look at these sweet babies. But yeah, you gotta come in. You gotta pet one. Take one for a walk. If you if you think it's interesting, come in, take it for a walk. Repetitive and annoying, but get your butt down here. Come see these babies. Take one home. Make it your forever baby. Hi. It always shocks me. I see some of these dogs, and I mean, some of them are purebred. Some of them are highly sought-after breeds. Um. These great Pyrenees, like, my God, I know they're a handful, I guess, but they're expensive dogs. And here's one in the shelter. Um, here's one of the Australian cattle dogs. He's a beauty. He's snoozing. We'll leave him be. Hi, babies.
show this angle of those two cuddling from earlier. And these little guys, oh, this little gray, or what is it, blue. Oh, you're beautiful. Get back up and cuddle with your buddy. I'm sorry. Hi. Husky, Sonia. Let's see here. Let me, I'll circle back around and I'll get you some info on the husky. I'm almost done with this lap and I'll walk around. Hi, baby. to walk back around and I'll find that white one. It's on collar for ya. It's okay. This boy's back here kind of chill. There's this tough guy again. <laughs> can find. Hopefully I can remember how far back it was. Okay. While I'm looking for the white husky with a pink collar, um, I'm just going to keep on telling people that you need to adopt and not shop. Um, this one's not it, is it? I don't think that one has a pink collar. So. for you, Sonia, so I can give you some info. If I can't find it while I'm doing my live, then I'll, uh, I'll message you afterwards and give you info on it. I'm not finding it just right off the bat, so. Let's see here. Yeah, I may not be able to find someone here in well. That one's not white. That one's a black one. Oh, Chris, there are handfuls of healers up here. Um, as soon as I saw the first one today, I thought about your new baby, and I was like, ah, you need another. Sonia, 
um, he's, he was the, oh, the black one, okay, we'll go back around to the black one, there's a couple here, actually, so, This row, oh, I missed it, it was the next row. Hi, baby. So, this one. Hi, baby. He's snoozing hardcore. Um, it says, Siberian Husky, black and white, approximate one year. Um, He's been here just shy of a month. Um, I'm guessing that's his, I don't think that's his, what, his weight. Possible German shepherd. But yeah, this is this baby. Hi. Oh, goodness. Hi, baby. Hi. Hi. Oh, yeah, let me hear you talk. Baby. Yeah, so they're saying he is uh, approximately one year old, uh, definitely large breed. He was taken in August 23rd as a stray. Um, I do know with all of their animals here, they get all their shots, uh, their current shots. Um, they get microchipped, spayed or neutered, and that's all covered in the uh, $60 adoption, or yeah, I think it's $60 adoption fee. Every now and then they have specials where they're $30 adoptions. Um, but yeah, that looked like he was a uh, pretty decent size uh, baby there. So I'm taking one more little scan through to see if I can find the white one that you talked about at first. And get you both. And then you can make a trip up here to the city and we can adopt you a baby and you and I can have lunch together and we can talk about old things. Oh, here's, now this guy, he's like a husky mix, but he's got a blue collar and he's the one that has a little face scratched. Oh, is this the one we're talking about? Here's a white baby. It's kind of white. Let me go see if I can see his info on his card. Let's see here. Which one were you in? Okay. So there's this one right here. And this one's a medium, they're saying medium size, three years old, gray white female. She was just taken in as a stray on the 19th of this month. And this is her, so I think she's gonna be a little smaller, but oh yes. She's beautiful. So is her sidekick here. Oh. So. So there's that other one, Sonia. I think that's the one you were talking about. It has a pink collar on it. It's a whiter color. Like I said, she's a... I think it said three years old. Yeah, around three years old and medium size. So let me know. Yes, she's a sweetheart. Hey, baby. Hi, oh, just want to lick. <laughs> Her little friend back there can't help himself. You should come up here, Sonia. You should come adopt this baby. I'll uh, make sure we get all of our info, so that's her number right there, A320986. And she is, let me tell you which, if you do decide to make the trip, she's in Kennel's 425 to 439. So, all right. Hi, babies. 
tricolor buffy bully i'm so okay tricolor bully okay let me think here tricolor bully there's a bunch of those so let me oh you're a cutie tricolor bully awesome sonia i'd love for you to come up here and adopt this little girl and have lunch with me Okay, Amy and Kendall Lowe, Tricolor Bully. So you're gonna have to help me out a little bit more, is it? Let's see here. Is that a, like this guy? <laughs> Second to the last. tricolor close to a brindle or did it have any white on it? I got us one. Oh, that's not really a bully. Let's see. Rottweiler mix of brown, white, brown, white, and black or blue. Brown, white, and black or blue. Okay. Let me see. in here so Yeah, I'm not seeing it right off the top, 
so it may be something you may have to swing by down here. I don't know if you're in the OKC area. Oh, that sweet baby. He wants to play. Yeah, you may have to come down here, Amy or Kendall. Um, because I'm not. Let me walk one other area. Yes, the one with the brown. Is that this one? One of these guys? I can see if our cards over there. one and a half years old. Um, he was, or she was taken in on September 12th. Um, I think it's showing like 30 pounds. Oh wait, not the pink. Not the pink collar. Oh, so they both, so they have pink paper. So this one over here is the one. This little guy. Oh, that one. Too. Yeah, they both have pink collars. But if it's this one, this one's more of a brownish blue, that blue color. If that's it, that one's a female as well. And it's saying large for her. And I think it's 50, around 50 pounds. She's two years old. And she was also taken in on the 12th. Both of these were taken in on the 12th. So, yeah, come on up here. They're, they're beautiful and they're very gentle too. They're probably two of the calmest. Um, so, I hate to say it, I imagine they'll go quickly. Oh, so it is one of the, if it's one of the two in here, they're both pit bull mixes, both female. Um, looking from their, their rumps right now, the one on the left is the larger size one, and she's two years if it's the one on the right. Okay, the one on the left facing us right now is a female large two years, and this one right here is a female medium one and a half year. So, both of them sweet as anything. Um, let me get you their, their numbers. So if it's this one right here, her number is A320446, and if it's that one, her number is A320449. And they are in the kennel run. Oh, I have to go down to the other end to get it. And they are... What side? Either 450, 440. Yeah, it's probably 450 to 440. You are most welcome. Get your hiney down here and save this baby. She wants you to make her your, make you a happy camper. All right. Okay, guys. So, um, that's extremely tough to do. I want you to know. Um, I know a lot of you don't want to come down here. Um, Believe it or not, I tear up in the car <laughs> before I come in here because um, you look at these faces and you know that they are, um, there's a high chance that they are not going to make it out of here. So I cannot stress it enough. Adopt. Do not buy from a breeder. Do not buy from a pet store. Um, don't get rid of your pet when they're old. Don't get rid of your pet when they're sick. Um, they are, they're children. My shirt. I'm a dog mom. 
um, my boyfriend, he's a dog dad. He had two when him and I got together and they were the, the world to us. So, um, I had dogs growing up. Um, we never dumped them. Heck, we lived in the country and we had so many people come out and dump their animals out there. So we had dogs, we had cats, um, ducks, other stuff. Um, but come down here to the shelter, um, get yourself, get yourself acquainted, um, volunteer, do whatever you need to, but come down here and make a difference. Um, it's worth it. I promise. Um, whenever you see anything on maps for, you know, vote yes, move all that forward. That's going to expand the size of the shelter, help things out. Um, but donate your time, um, energy, come down here, pet, walk a dog, but make a difference. Um, if you're still watching or if you've watched this after the fact, share my video. Let's get the word out. Um, come down here. It, it's not going to hurt you. It's going to make you cry a little probably, and that's okay because it just, it's the reality. Um, so if anything, um, you, you want to buy a $1,500 dog, uh, like what are the possibilities? You want to buy it for your kid for Christmas. Um, donate that money to the shelter and then just come down here because everyone always says kids get tired of dogs. So definitely, um, donate your money and just come down here. Don't, don't buy a dog for $1,500. Come down here and get one for, you know, they have specials where they're 30. They have specials where they're free, but donate that money and then come down here and adopt a dog who wants to come home with you. So, all right, well, I'm going to get off here. Um, I'm glad so many of you jumped on, uh, share this video, get the word out. Um, let's find all these babies homes. So I will be down here again next Friday. Um, what time do they close? I think they close at five. Let me double check. I'll come ask somebody because I'm not exactly sure. I think it's five though. So hang on just a sec. Oops, turned it around. So, let's find a worker. I want to say it's 5 o'clock, but let me double check. What time do you all close? 5.30. 5.30, okay, thank you. They close at 5.30, Amy and Kendall, so you can come down here. You can come down and you can adopt that baby. So um, hopefully you do get down here. Um, it would just make me ecstatic. So if you do, tag me. I want to see those pictures. Um, tag me and let me know that you adopted that baby. But uh, I'll be down here every Friday. Um, anyone who wants to join, come down here. I'll meet you. Text me, message me on Facebook. Um, I'll come down here with you your first time. And we'll walk the, the kennels and take a dog home. Or you can just, you know, spread the video, walk a dog, do whatever it is. But um, I will see you guys next time, and uh, I hope this made a difference. Bye, guys.